It's a good day. Welcome back, everybody, to Undead Legacy. I'm an old guy gaming in. In this episode, we're going to go thump some zombos, uh, do some more POIs, uh, work on the clear mission that we have um, in search of two more beakers so we can do the upgrade for this. Um, I think... Uh, yeah, that's that's all all we need that's going to be hard to get. The rest of the stuff's not that big of a deal. Um, so I did just a little bit more work on the corner of the building after I left you guys in the last episode. And um, I'll just show you how how far along we are on the floor. We still, we still have a, a lot of concrete. Oh, my goodness. We have a lot of concrete uh, to do. You know, one thing I guess I could consider doing is just have, like, the pillars be concrete and do the floor and the outs <clears throat> excuse me and the outside walls and then maybe do the floors in wood um i don't know i'll think about that anyway let's uh let's go ahead and, and make sure we're all geared up and ready to rock and roll and so let's see we've got two things of chamois chowder that's not a lot um but if we take the gumbo stew with us as well because we're already good on food and water i think we'll be fine for that uh, we have 15 mineral water, so we're good on beverage. We want to take some eye candy with us in particular. And uh, I think that's all we probably need for there. Looks like all of our weapons are uh, uh, are upgraded. We got full stacks of ammo. Uh, we got meds. So yeah, I think we're in pretty good shape. I'm going to let's open this up for a second. Let's not take the Valkyrie drill. We'll take the impact driver. Uh, we'll take the nail gun. Uh, and oh yeah, and this thing here. We don't need the uh, that. Okay, good. Everything else I think we'll take with us. And let's go. I'll meet you guys at the the location that we're heading to. All right, we're just right across the street here, actually. Um, we are doing the, the sideways building. I haven't done this quest in a while, uh, but I have done it a few times. Uh, it is going to get dark on us, too, so that's going to add an uh, extra layer of excitement to all of these shenanigans. All right, let's do this. This is a clear, so we got to kill them all. Kill them all and let God sort them out. All right. Um, Incoming enemies, prepare for conflict. Just you? He did. Oh. Hold still. We don't have um we don't have any points in pistols, so we need to start using the pistol to get those points. Uh we're not we're no longer going out of our way to loot electronic stuff because we no longer get research data for that. And I've got plenty of the actual parts that they it gives, so in case you're wondering, that's what the deal is with that. Well, let me make sure everything else is loaded. Yep, we're looking good. Okay. Check for wall safes. Right. Come on around the corner, boys. Same old loot. The good thing about that same old loot, though, is we get steroids out of it. The other stuff's okay, but the steroids are, are the thing. Hold still. He did. All right, let's check this. Check this. No coffee in there. I don't have anything compatible to yada, yada, yada. And I think we have to go up that way, but let's unlock this first. 
Let's spend a bunch of effort and break a lock back unlocking this so that we can get three dollars. All right, four hundred eighty-four dollars. Never mind. <laughs> a little bit of rope action. Master, oh we shit! Are not alone. Is that a cop or a? Yeah, that's a copper. All right, so there's the stairwell going up. Got a little food pile back there. The cop was eating on the food pile. Actually, if he was eating on that, I don't know if I want to eat on it. Um, Is there a way up this way? No, I don't think so. Okay. We just came through there. Okay, let's go up the stairs. We are checking basic trash and stuff because of books. We need books. All right, nobody in here. There's something down there? I don't think so. There's a pallet down there, but I don't see anything else loot-wise. Probably a zombadoodle in there. Yep. Can we just tag his head that way? Nope. We're probably going to get rushed. I've got a bad feeling about this. Off with your head. Look at this. Nice. See, now the thing about mini bike maintenance is we need to learn it in order to, you have to learn these in succession. So we don't give a shit about mini bikes, but um, is it going to let us learn it now or do we have to learn must know bicycle maintenance? Well, do we? I don't think we do, do we? Yeah. Okay. So those are very valuable and we want to, you know, hang on to them. And it's nighttime now, too, by the way, so yay us. We're going to have to probably go into stealth mode now, so we won't be using the pistol so much. We'll use the crossbow as much as we can in melee. Anything else in here? I've uh, done this POI just infrequently enough to not be super familiar with it. Hey, there's our bolt, or one of them anyway. All right. There's another bolt. Take it. Uh. You know what? I don't. I think she. Goodbye then, for now. I think Roberta makes us less stealthy, doesn't she? We don't, uh, there we go. There's some research data. I don't remember if I can sneak over trash or not. Oh. I'm really surprised we haven't gotten the attention of outside Zeke's yet. I'm sure it'll happen though. All right, I th think we might get a rush in here. Don't remember. Like from the ceiling, maybe? Yeah. All right. Oh, I'm stuck in the door. Well, that's probably going to get some outside Zombo's attentions. We got thumped pretty good there. Coffee maker. It's 
some gunpowder and brass in there. Okay, none of that stuff's all that great. It's okay, but not the best. Up to the third floor. And then I think we got to deal with a few Zikaroos on this roof and then head over to the sideways building. Let's go back to stealth mode here. Um, in case, in case you guys don't know this, or, or unless something's changed since the last time I checked it, my light does not affect sleepers. It doesn't make me more noticeable to sleepers. It's more noticeable to, to the zombies that are awake and walking around, but not to sleepies. And a while back, I proved that in a video. But again, oh, here we go. We need that stuff. That was, um, wasn't un, I don't think it was undead legacy. I think it was vanilla, but that's probably not something Subquick would change because it's more of a core game function, you know? Here, we should just sneak over some trash. I think, I think I have, oh, I think I have that. Oh shit. We're gonna probably need to use shotgun on this guy. Hold still! Oh no! He was like wiggling like a big fat bowl of lard and I couldn't get a shot off on him. Oh no! <laughs> That's the first time we've died in a long time. Son of the bitch. Alright, well, um. Now we're going to have to get back in there and get our stuff. Crap. <laughs> oh, nuts. Okay. Well, let's go get our second set of gear on. We didn't even get killed by outside sleepies. I figured if we were going to get killed at all, it would have been from them. Um, all right. Let's get a crossbow. And I think we'll just take the FAR. Yeah. I don't want to take a lot of extra stuff because we're going to have to make room for what we currently have. I'll grab that sledgehammer. You know what? Actually, um, I'm not going to take the crossbow. Let's just take these two weapons. Oh, but we need to get our uh, we need to get our second armor set on. So uh, let's take some night vision and steel chest armor. We'll wear that. Steel gloves. That's got a light on it. Steel pants and I guess iron boots. Here, let's wear, wear military boots. Okay, so we're re, re kitted out there. Uh, let's wear these as well. Okay, that'll at least help us stay sneaky while we're outside. We'll chug down a few stews here to get our, our food, water, and health back up. How much do we get? 50 for each of those. Now that should get us pretty close to the top there. Um, and let's even top it off with another mineral water too. Okay, so we just need some ammo and then... We're good to go back out. Ammo is going to be in here. We'll take a stack of 556. Five, All right, let's go. 
We're going to go down the fast way. I haven't been down this way in a while. Okay, sneaky sneak. Be very, very quiet. Oh, we failed the damn quest too, didn't we? <laughs> Forgot about that. Oh well. Um, what time is it? It is 23.55, yeah. We'll, we'll finish going through the POI anyways because we're, the quest wasn't the main reason why we were doing it. I don't know where all the Zeeks are tonight. They're usually out in force <clears throat> at nighttime. Not complaining. Just pointing it out. When you flush, think of us. That's been in the game for a while. Okay, this bottom floor should be clear. So let's just move. And came through here and came around through here. through here up to the next floor and over here now I don't think we killed that cop pretty sure we didn't so he's gonna be back in business <coughs> excuse me all right let's get resituated here with our um, armor good stuff back on that can go down there no not that goes there this goes here oops I need to I need to do some armor repairing for sure Okay, I think, I think we're good to go. Am I forgetting something? Probably, but I don't know what it is. Okay, let's do this. Nope, we want to turn these lights off and just use night vision. Where is that bastard? He's probably not in a place we can snipe him. We're not messing around with him either. We're bringing out the big gun. Irradiated cops, bad juju. Very bad juju. That son of a bitch is. Man, it is an amazingly quiet night. Guess it was, this was a good night to go out and loot at nighttime. Nothing there. Does look like we can get through there? One thing of mineral water. Um, let's drink this. Excuse me, guys. I'm still dealing with a a cough here. Pain in the ass, man. <clears throat> I did uh, take a COVID test yesterday, just a home test, and it was negative, so that's good. 
So it's just a normal cold or some variant of the normal cold. Okay. Now, um, I don't know, are we going to have to find any more on this side of the building? I guess we're going to find out in a second, huh? Can't quite get up there. Okay. Let's go up here for a minute. There's probably some things to loot up here. I just don't remember what it would be. I think that's a trash pile. Oh, there's a bird's nest up here with some eggs in it. Look at that. Well, hopefully there's eggs in it. Not that we need eggs. <laughs> I got a ton of eggs. Here we go. We need those books, baby. Some electrical parts there. Nice. <clears throat> nice, nice, nice. Cowboy boots and some canned food. Alright. That was worth coming up here for. Okay, let's sneak over this trash. Yeah, it didn't make noise. Okay. I just couldn't remember. When you start when you've done this many episodes, what the heck are we even on? I don't know, episode one hundred thousand million. <laughs> you kind of start to forget. You know, uh, all of this stuff that you've accomplished or learned. Or at least I do, because I'm old. That's what happens when you get old. Alright, I think we're okay through this hallway. Maybe. But we're going to have to drop down, and probably when we drop down, we're going to run into some friends. So let's get this ready to go. Yep. Just him? Yeah. Alright. We need more health. What does this give us for health? 56. No, let's not burn that for that purpose. Uh, we only have two painkillers. Alright. We're going to take a small bandage. And I think it wants us to go that way. The first time I did this POI, it hadn't <clears throat> really registered in my brain that it was on its side. And I'm going, what kind of place is this? <laughs> All right, let's go up. You know, it wants us to go up. I'm going to, um, I'm going to turn this off and put this on. But there's probably stuff to loot down here. Like a sewing kit, for example. There's some desks in disarray over there, but I'm not going to jump um, over there just for desks that are in disarray. Well, okay, I guess we're going down here. <laughs> We've seen those sinks on their side. That's hilarious. All right, how the heck do I get out of here again? Go up this way. Go through here, maybe? There's a bird's nest. With an egg in it that we don't need. Um, alright, are we gonna have to pull out of here? Um, let's go over here. At some point, it would be useful to invest in parkour. It's definitely a useful skill. It's just not one that I've really, um, you know, felt like was a real high priority. And don't get me wrong. I mean, if you use that skill right, it, it can be make a huge difference, you know, in being able to jump up on high places to get away from Zeke's. Um... You know, maybe I should think about, you know, give it more consideration in the future for that reason alone. But 
part of the thing that makes this POI a pain in the ass is <laughs> if you fall down, you have to, you know, figure out how to get back up. So, hey, we got some bullets out of that. Now I hear some outside Zeeks. We've got a uh, running horde coming through, so let's just hunker down for a second. I'm just waiting for them to disperse as much as possible. I think the problem is, though, that they're all being blocked by the building. They've heard me because feral sense is on. Ah, I don't want to fall down there now. Here. Oh, shit. All right, where's that ladder that we were climbing up? I don't remember where it is. We went down to check this place out. Was it over here? Yeah, there's the ladder right there. Okay. Is in a vending machine over there. There's a purse. All right, so I guess we jump down on this desk and then on this beam and then up to here. All right, where do we go from here? Um, hmm. Use door? It's locked. Did we drop down through here? Maybe? Yes, no, maybe so. There's some bucks down there. Okay, we can't go that way. It's, there's a light in here, so I guess we go this way. <clears throat> but once we're in here, can we drop down again? Here, let's, let's take another one of these. How much health does this give? Oh, 80. Well, they found a path to us. So the safest thing to do is probably just to stay right here. Let them come to us, hopefully in onesie twosies, and take them out. 
I just saw a zombo up there. Oh, this is the an upside down stairwell. That is such a trip, man. How about the fun pimps had fun making this PR? Come at me, bro. Hard to tell exactly where he's at. Oh, is he close? He might be caught somewhere. Okay, let's just keep moving. There's a bookshelf. It's a trap. Don't do it. We're not. We're going to do it the safe way. Oh, it's not letting me put anything down there. I don't want to risk it. Not even for a biscuit. Four pieces of paper. Seriously? Uh, I don't think those bookshelves have books in them, but I can't tell for sure. They look empty. Pretty sure they are. Okay. Let's go this way. Let's keep this ready in case we fall through the floor. Alright, I guess it just wants us to jump this gap. And up we go. Yeah. We might knock our head if we jump that way, so let's go this way. That was lucky. Get up. Let's take night vision back off because the zombies know we're here, so there's not really much point in trying to be stealthy. Oh, and it's morning. That's even better. Okay. I'd like to say we survived the night, but <laughs> you know how that went. It didn't quite work that way. There's some books on the floor in there. Yep. There's some research data. Whoops, I didn't mean to turn that on. The thing is, is that I don't know where they exactly where they're all at. Oh, books. Nice. That almost sounds close. Oh, there you are. I want to open a sideways door. we go this way maybe no I don't think so uh, there's a backpack down there are you guys back over here Well, I think, I think we dropped down here. If not, well, we just did. Oh, we got some pain pills for our trouble and a wall safe. There you go. Uh, 
I feel like we're gonna get ambushed while we're trying to do the wall safe. Well, if we do, we do. We're back to full health anyway, so. You know what? Let's learn that. We might want to make one of those someday. Okay, so will we go through? Oh, look at that. We have ourselves a sniping opportunity. There you are. Okay. Looks like we have some parkour to do here. Walk up the beam. Walk around through here. Coffee maker with one charge of coffee. What do you know? We got so much crap in our inventory here. The cabinet with some water. Oh shoot. That didn't sound good. Oh! Alright, that woke me up. Got dropped right on my head practically. Check the microwave. We did now. All right, time to climb up the air conditioner units. Oh, these are the chairs you guys were telling me will give me um, military fiber. Let's grab those. Heads clear up at the top. Make the jump there. All right. Up to the roof. Really? Spawned right in front of our face. Uh, we don't need any water out of the water barrel. Um, let's see. I'm going to grab this stuff because... We have a few more crop plots I think we need to make. And uh, the thing that we ran out of was the uh, spoiled meat. Alright, before we. Well, here, let's just loot first. Loot and lag. Decent amount of ammo. Three mineral water charges in there. Scrap this for research data. Where are my bombs? 
Pipe bombs, pipe bombs. Wherefore art thou? Here you are. I knew I had them this time. All the bad guys are right down here. And there's a lot of them. It's a good day. <laughs> oh man, that never gets old. Okay, let's open these up. Crack a book box. All right, more research data for us. Chamois box. A blueberry pie, huh? All right, we're not hungry, so we'll save that. More decent stuff there. And I th are we going to need to take a... Yeah, we're going to need to take a jailbreaker. You'd think by now we'd be able to open these, but not yet. Ah, shoot. I forgot to take the eye candy. Dog, on it. Oh, gee. Uh, I don't care. I don't like trigger burst. So we'll turn that into research data. Oh well. More, more eye candy for next time, I suppose. Let's loot this. Another book. That's good. Anything down here? Who do you top? Okay. I think that's it, ladies and gentlemen. up this way oh look at our building with the elevator that is cool <laughs> uh all right so let's see what did we ultimately end up with in terms of books and research data uh, we found this mini bike maintenance which was a really good find i think we have the truck maintenance too that we found that we're sitting on uh we have 200 research data and five books so that yeah i mean that could have gone better uh in that regard but if this does indeed turn into military fiber in the breakdown station, uh, those were worth grabbing too. In fact, did I get all of them up here? I think we did. Here, let me double check. I wasn't specifically looking for those. And they're not something I would normally loot, so... I don't see any down this way. Okay. Okay. Let's go back to the base, and I want to throw those in the recycling station and see if, if they'll turn into military fiber. What's that guy doing down there? Oh, come on. Um, okay, let's jump down through here, and then jump down through here. That's a bit of a drop there, unless we land on this first. And, uh, it's still kind of a bit of a drop, isn't it? Well, we're committed now. <clears throat> okay, we're good. Oh, more books. Okay, good. Uh, we need to go this way. We 
might just have to cut our way out of here. Oh, maybe not. There we go. Home free. Okay, let's stick these in here. Um, ooh, I wonder if that gives... That probably doesn't give military fiber. But we'll stick it in there anyway and see what happens. Um, Alright, yeah. Turn that on. No, that's just cloth. Okay. Very nice. Look at that. Okay, fantastic. While we're at it, let's throw some other stuff in here too. That can be recycled. That can be recycled. Those can. Those can. Those will sell. Steel rebar. Uh, no, 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 not those. Do these give um fiber? Oh, those are already broken down into their parts, so we can't recycle them further. Okay. Cool. Um Well, I think that's gonna wrap up this episode here then, guys. Um next episode, we'll probably do the same thing. We'll just go out and do some more zombo bashing and, and try our hand at another quest without dying and failing it. And, um, yeah, we'll, at some point we'll get back to, oh, actually, you know what? Let's go check the garden and, uh, see what's going on with that real quick before I let you go. I need, I'm going to put a couple things away just so I can move a little faster. All right. We were going to, we we're going to wait for, for these crops to mature and then we were going to move those over. That's right. I forgot about that. Well, we still might want to make more crop plots, though, later. So, but everything is growing. This is looking good. And uh, we're going to have a nice little farm going on up here when it's all completely set up. Let's harvest the honey out of here. And I think I'm going to leave the eggs in the hen house because we've, we've got them coming out our ears already. But we want to keep the honey going. Very good. All right, guys, I'm going to let you go here. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.